What the hell are we waiting on? What are we waiting on? Do you want it or not? Do you understand there's a price to pay? You can be a world champion, but not like this. Let's make sure we play like the New York Jets. That's what I want to see tomorrow. Do we understand what the f I want to see tomorrow? Let's go to eat a damn snack. Shahed! 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 Do it again, my fault. Here we go, I'm not a quarterback. Obviously you can tell. Stretch is way overrated. Did you know World War I, World War II, all those guys that fought in that war, right? They did push-ups, jumping jacks, sit-ups, climbed the rope and ran. But none of this fancy, okay? Right, and they won two world wars. Two world wars by doing jumping jacks, push-ups, and sit-ups. Two world wars. You think they were worried when they're running across Normandy about stretching? Are you kidding me? Child, please. Hey, that's one of them like, child, please. Child, please. You know what child, please mean? Child, please is a nice way of telling someone, you know, you. Like if somebody come to you, if coach come to you and be like, man, did he cover you? You can just look at coach and be like, man, coach, child, please, because you really disrespecting me, right? Like, I really don't need to explain this to you, but if I say it with some, with some, some oomph. Child, please. Child, please. That's like, man, f you too. Next, we got Tim. Tim is going to portray our tight end. <laughs> I know the Baltimore Ravens been hit with a lot of injuries. Though. Yes, yes, we have. <laughs> <laughs> I seen that special on HBO, School of Hard Knocks, when um, Sarah Gooser had locked the tight ends in the room. You humiliated me, dude, on national television. So I want restitution. What? Well, yeah, I, I knew that Goose had something. <laughs> I knew Goose had something to do with that, and I told Goose then, I said, Goose, I want my restitution. You and <laughs> Make sure we compete today, all right? It's all about the peak. That's a Bob the Builder, bro. You had to get that special made. No, <laughs> oh, but what you mean, special you made? You ain't going to get that, no. I ain't seen the shorts like that in a while. Look here. It ain't no need to scream. <laughs> it ain't no need to holler. OK. I need you to save your energy. Yeah. To kiss the baby. OK. Kiss the baby on three. One, two, three. Kiss, kiss the baby. baby. You think you can stop me, period. You can kiss the baby. Kiss the baby is basically a statement similar to her when the fat lady sings. Basically trying to explain that when you, when, the, when you kiss the baby, whatever the situation is, mean it's over. The rest of the competition or feel might as well kiss the baby, because this is over. Basically, if they want to line up on you, they might as well kiss, kiss the, baby. the baby. Okay, there you, they go. Might not there you come go. home. There you go. You know there you go. Johnson isn't the only Texan tearing it up. DeAndre Hopkins is playing like a number one receiver. Man, listen, I win the route. I win the route. You do that shit to me? Man, talk to us, me, boy. What the fuck wrong with you, boy? I'm a grown ass man, dog. Just like you. Well, we can box. I feel God, homie. I feel God. I feel God, boy. I feel God, boy. I feel God, boy. I'm just like you now. We both tell these boys feel God now. I'm gonna slap the fuck out of you, too. Watch. Before somebody touching me after the play is over and talking about what they gonna do to me, coach, that's not gonna. Hey, hey it's our wolf talk. I know. Okay? So let's come over here. Let's come over here. They're about, here. Shit, they're about to get you riled up. Oh, 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 
throat, it's might hurt. Oh, I'm already breaking ankles. And further they'll pass, I already breaking ankles on the route. Shit. Hey, I just finished it. I just finished it. I don't start nothing. Alonzo, who is five. I have um, Karis, who is three. I have my my junior, which is three. I have a my daughter, who just turned three as of yesterday. Um, I have another son named Tyler. That's uh, he turns three in December. I got another uh, daughter that was born October 16th, named London. Uh, another daughter that was born named Leilani, who's uh, two years old. And uh, I have uh, my newborn with my wife. Her name is Jersey. I'll show you how I do it. That's how we do it in Fort Wayne. We got dancers. We got dancers in Fort Wayne. I'm going to show y'all. <laughs> On. Love you, man. We needed a quarterback on the team who had a lot of neck. We got a good guy for that, man. Dame School signing bonus. John Gruden, University of Dayton. I do this shit for free. You know why? Because I fucking love football. <laughs> Knock on wood if you're with me. <laughs> I watched something the other night that impressed me tremendously. A guy by the name of Hunter Renfro. It's pretty spectacular, man. I'm gonna uh, put the card in here and we're gonna take you here with the first pick in the draft. Hello, this is John Dorsey. How you doing, buddy boy? <laughs> <laughs> Playing in the National Football League, it's a blessing. It's a privilege. Not many people get to do it. You know what I mean, buddy boy? That's cool stuff, huh? <laughs> and buddy boy, that is what I call the 2018 Rookie Show. You know what I mean? Brand new caddy, caddy. 